Oh my god, I've got to take that up to the unit, up to the office. It's going to be a busy, busy day today. I've got so much to do. I've got to take stuff in the office, bring stuff out, knock stuff. Down. Oh, just. This is a heavy load, man. Oh. Hope this doesn't weigh more than 26 persons. <sighs> Another day. Right, so I suppose the best thing is I don't have any postage to do. I've just got organization. I need to make stacks and take stuff home. That all needs to come home. I need to bring my void fill, boxes, stuff. Just stuff. I literally don't know where to start. I'm just gonna start filling Amazon bags up and literally just ram stuff in it. Just chuck it in, chuck it in. Why am I bringing stuff back in if I'm clearing stuff out? Well, the fact is the people that I was doing consignment for are happy to take back all the stuff and me too. So all of that stuff that's over there, they can come and get it. I think that might do for that one. Any small little bits in there? Because of what's in there, I don't want it to be too heavy. Let's go again. But looking for these, all of my tops trading. Tidemen cards. You know, I bet they've lost all their value now. I didn't strike while the arm was hot, did I? I've got lots of sealed media, probably about another stack like that at home, just this kind of stuff. For any of you Amazon lot out there, I am going to reach out to recover the riches first because he asked me to keep an eye out for some for him. Some good little bits in there for Amazon. The prices are massively different, Amazon to eBay, so they'll do better. that one hold too heavy okay now I need to work on some tools I need to bring supplies back so I think I'm going to drag those other bags in now get those done probably going to take this out as well so I don't actually lose the walkway otherwise I'll be completely screwed self sensor no, for the... oh, no, I'll probably leave that one there actually That's going to fall soon, isn't it? Let me get sorted, I'll come back to you. I think I'm going to make up an Amazon bag full of all my office supplies. Boxes, bags, tape, all that kind of stuff. It would be handy to have that back there. So then I know I've only got to come here purely, purely to move stuff. Oh, would you believe it? This room is can swelter in again. Swelter in. So I just recorded a whole segment of me clearing out under here. I was speaking to the camera, talking about my scales, talking about all these kinds of things. Didn't even press record. So I filled up an Amazon basket full of office supplies, basically. So that's going to be the next one that goes on the trolley. And I did say that it's so hot in here that once that trolley's full, I'm out of here again. I'm gone. I'm out. I'm gone. Go home and do some work from there. Whew. So a few people the other day have been asking me if I've been working out. Yes, I have, but nowhere near as much as what I looked the other day. I was wearing a t-shirt that was about 10 times too small for me. My mate Rick gave me it, so I thought I'd better wear it once on the video. But I've not been working out enough to look like that. That's just 
That's just congealed fat just bursting out of a t-shirt made for Ada. Right, I think that's going to be my... Let's take the tripod home, shall we? I think that's going to be the last of it. I've got that bag ready to go. These are staying. A few more bits to sort out. That needs to be cleared off. This needs to come home. So does that. And I can probably do that in. Let's be realistic now. Let me seriously think about this. Three trips, three trips. I'm calling it three more trips back maximum and I'm done. Well, let's get home. I got stalled here for a minute. Something very strange just happened. So yesterday I recorded a sponsorship video with Munbin, which you've probably seen by now. And the reason why us YouTubers take sponsorship deals, as long as they're in line with what we're making content about, is because making videos isn't free. It either costs us time, costs us money, or costs us time and money. So where we can, if we can get our pockets lined a little bit for our work and our efforts, then we will. Ad revenue is a nice little bonus, but so are these sponsorships. Some people just haven't got a clue, honestly. So if you're one of these people that get pissed off every time you see a YouTuber doing an ad, try and have a little bit of understanding, will ya? I mean, if the YouTuber is a reseller and does a Raid Shadow Legends or whatever i get it i understand i've done quickbooks and still do quickbooks timu which is great for ordering supplies and other office pieces and things like out for your business and now munbin they all align get a grip but that wasn't supposed to be released until 6 p.m tonight yet jason gurney was able to see it and comment and i'll show you it was unlisted here's a screenshot i'm not being a techno for a video so the video was unlisted and scheduled but it was still viewing so it's a weird little glitch that is. So I've had to release it early, so you've probably already seen it by now anyway, but I'm not even joking, the print is sick. Still gonna use my trusty zebra though, until that packs up. But I am gonna have the Wi-Fi printer in the living room, so everyone has access to it. Does that make sense? It's a precarious load today. In and out by half past 10 today. So the job now is to go home, unload, stack it onto the shelves, put things where I need to put it, and then do the postage. Oh boy. My eBay store is fucking dying, mate. It's dying a death. Right, I need to go road. And we made it home, obviously. I've actually got something to show you in there. I went out last night about half past four and legged it to the range and bought nine 80 litre boxes for like 85 quid which really hurt to be fair because it's fucking boxes and there are some on sale normally you have to catch them at the right time like four quid a box five quid a box these were nine pound 89 but i just wanted some asap because obviously storage and organization is going to be key in that sweat box it's not even a sweat box i don't know why i called it that yeah i do because it's small like a police carrier guy king lost in your garage google maps is your I don't mean lost as in I don't know where I am. I mean lost as in like, it's a new space, bro. Fresh comment on a fresh video that was. So I don't know, it's going to intertwine somehow. Let's get in there. I tell you, that garage door does not like it when the sun's been shining on it all day. It sounds like it's just going to give up and pack up halfway through. So there we go. Much nicer. You see what I mean about how I measured these perfectly to fit 80 litres in. That's why they're all level now. So... 80 litres all the way down. We are eventually going to fill the whole row with 80 litres, all the way across, every last little thing. And the top is going to be for boxes, board games, things like that, stereos, whatever else, and like smaller pieces like that slip in there. So organisation is key. Before you all jump down my neck, I've already seen the error of my ways and I've gone A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, instead of going A, B, C, D. It, I saw it, all right? It annoyed me too. That's all going to be organised today with like them box trays that i bought out so i'm gonna have like small medium large bags blah blah blah, whatever else that'll all be cleared off because that's not staying there that's just quickly so yeah it's a lot better but yeah nine of those for 85 quid my postman always leaves little notes with smiley faces on i'm hoping that's my tiktok tripod yeah it looks like it doesn't it hopefully we're going to start getting some better angles now if that's the tripod you know i can't wait i have to get in there too i'm sure it is it feels like it yeah boy wow it's heavy feels solid it's like a police baton not one of you flinched did you well you know i don't like to read instructions i like to just figure stuff out so that goes okay so that's 
So then that just, I guess you might just have to pull it. Solid, very solid. But apparently this is like six feet, seven feet. I'm six foot one, six foot two. Decent. Does it feel solid with the phone on though? That's the main question. Let's find out. Hello. Yeah, sound. That's great. It's, it's solid. As soon as I put it down, I want it just, I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do them kids' dances. Yeah, buzzing with that. Lovely jubbly. That's fantastic. Yeah. And obviously we can go. Hi, welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're gonna talk about stuff. Love that. What's the selfie capability like? Ooh. Buzzing. A remote control. I never use those things. Right, sweet brother, happy with that. Let's try some spots. The packing angle, lots of different packing angles. Okay, we've got the picking angles. Obviously there won't be no bright light out there. The picking angles, I'm happy with this. Not sponsored, just paid for it. So as mentioned, today is more of a sorting day. I want to get things organized. I've got a few things to pack, but I showed you those yesterday. I might have one or two more. Let's get that light up. But um, I mainly want to focus on organizing today. I think the first job is to go from this to this. Still got a bit of organizing to do, and of course. But then we need to go from this to this. And some of you may notice, I'm actually going to give the mun bin a proper chance. I'm going to use all of those labels up. And then once they're done, I'm going to go in with a roll and I'm going to use the roll as well. And for anyone who hasn't seen it, Andrew put a video out about the mun bin as well. But he had a very opposite experience and he made a very valid point. Nobody really knows what they're like after just a couple of uses. But I was asked to give my review on my initial response and my initial use. And so far, so good. Things do go wrong. Of course, things go wrong. But yesterday experience was bliss so i am going to give it a full-on shot so it should take probably a month or so i should imagine no i don't know how many is in a roll probably a month actually to be fair not with the state of my ebay it might take me two years at this rate but it's okay i'm moving these things happen things get put on back burners things are happening it's okay it's all good we can revive it we can get the defibrillator out give it some cpr bring it back to life so I think for the rest of the day, I'm just going to carry on sorting and that's going to be very boring for you lot. So I really do appreciate you watching. As always, your time is valuable and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.